where you could see already the Bucks being very aware of pushing the ball, and also they're giving a little bit of a token backcourt pressure on the Denver guards, which is what they want to do. Here's David Thompson, the four million dollar man. He misses. It's a rebound. David Thompson made a pair of free throws to cut the margin to two as Milwaukee holds the lead, 18-16. The Bucks now with four team fouls, and the Nuggets two. And an important factor, Quinn Buckner has two personal fouls. And Issel dunks it, and we're tied at 18. Issel rebounding, Wilkerson up the floor, 41-38 Milwaukee. Bo Ellis in the game for Denver, number 31. Up set, Dan Issel. Well, this is a club you can't turn your head. They pass the ball very nicely. They'll go back door, and if you're a defensive player, you turn your head to watch the ball, your man just might get a dunk. Timeout is called, and uh, both teams need it. Let's look at here's, the action here. Here's the replay. dunk by David Thompson. The ball goes into his, so now Thompson boots away from the ball, back door, and he goes up and does what he does well. Denver won the opening game, 119-103. Alex English. Hits a rebound. He had Ellis there with him, and Denver dominated the defensive board. David Thompson to Roberts on the baseline. Hitzel. He can hit from there and die. 56-53 Denver. That shows you his versatility. Not only does he go inside, he goes outside. Roberts to Hitzel. Watched by Aiken. Thank you. The Nuggets open a little room here. 60 to 53, largest lead of the game. Winners calling the play. Myers at the top of the key. Myers watched by Roberts. Up over. Misses. Rebound Ellis. Five seconds left. Calvin driving. Calvin for Issel. Thank you. 60 to 53. And time runs out. And a foul call. Well, the Nuggets really doing a super job of getting the ball on the court. Dave Myers a little upset at that. He felt he was fouled in the backcourt. But look at it here. The advancement by Calvin. He brings it up. He goes inside because Myers comes over to help out. Gives it off. And Myers fouls this one as he puts the ball in. And so with time expired, Dan Issel has a chance to make a three-point play. The Nuggets lead it 62 to 53 and they now have a 10-point margin suddenly in the final couple of minutes here in the first half the denver nuggets have exploded to a 10-point lead over the milwaukee bucks 63 to 53. a 16-point margin for the denver nuggets here in the third quarter and look at this portland has come back to tie seattle they trailed by 10 in that game and a little more than that earlier Wilkerson back for Denver to Issel. Issel underneath Jones. And that's it. Bobby Jones, 71 to 53. Denver hot, but really in the first half, their rebounding was a big factor. Jones, Wilkerson, number 32 with the ball. Dan Issel underneath Jones. David Myers fell down. He was hurt and is still getting up now and back into the action, but he was completely out of the play. Watched by Roberts, and that won't go off the back rim. Roberts rebounds. Wilkerson with Thompson and Issel. Issel alone. There it is again, the fast break. The Bucks not getting back, and once they do, they're not picking up the men. But the Nuggets do a nice job of finding the trailers as well as the front men. Issel rebounding, and Roberts could not catch up with the pass from Bobby Jones. Issel with 20 points. Here's the last play to Issel. Bobby Wilkerson coming up. Issel wide open. No one even saw him.